Okay, now a little bit of quietness is coming over. Okay, a little bit. Are you sure about this? About this? Speak up, X Not. Yes, sir. Quite sure. I poured over all of, all our research of the Thousand Year Door, and it appears the sealing power has definitely been weakening, as Beldum said. Finally, the treasure of legend, the ancient power of darkness, will soon be ours. Listen and listen well. Keep giving the Crystal Star Search top priority. Of course, that also includes the elimination of Mario, that metal and scum. Got it, sir. Soon I will have the power that has slept for a, for a millennium. So very soon, and when I, and when that glorious day dawns, I will throw I'll throw the world into the depths of terror. No one can stop me now. All will kneel before the X Not regime, and then I, Grotus, will build a new world, a perfect ideal world. Yes, a world made by me, about me, and for me. Gak 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 gak. <laughs> I wish you had that Eggman laugh. You know the oh ho 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 ho. That that laugh. You know. Made me so Eggman. Tech, did you call me? Did you call me? I think this is the quiz thing, kind of. What shall I do today? Will it be dancing, perhaps? Disguising? Or will I sing a song or something? Oh, that'd be nice! I love girls that could sing. I... I am conflicted. Huh? What's wrong, Tech? You don't seem yourself. Which is more important? Carrying out an order or protecting a critical person? I exist for the purpose of a certain person. I wish to exist for the purpose of another. I do not know what to do, really. What do you mean? No, no, never mind. Please forget my musing. My musings. I do not know why, but it makes me feel unpleasant if I make you worry. Well, in any case, let's have a quiz. A quiz? That's right, Princess Peach. Please answer the questions that I am about to ask you. If you can answer five questions, you may use the communicator as usual. What's with you all of a sudden, huh? Now the first question. I think when I was when I, when I first played this, I was confused as to why he's doing this until I realized that obviously he's been programmed and stuff, or how he is. He is like ordered or forbidden to reveal information of what's uh, what, about the Thousand Year Door and all other critical informations. So what he's doing is he's basically bypassing all of that by basically having Peach answer uh, answer a few questions. So it's basically her answering these questions while Tech is just giving out questions. That basically bypasses what you know these this thing he has and is able to let Peach know without him actually telling her the major stuff that's happening, basically. That's what I- that's what I just found out, you know? Okay, now for the first question. What will happen if you collect seven crystal stars? Your wish is granted, a thousand your door open, a thousand coins appear, a thousand your door opens. Correct. Now the second question. What is the goal of Grotus, leader of the x -Nons? To conquer the world, to get rich, to become a superhero, to conquer the world. Correct. Now the third question. What is the legendary treasure that waits behind the thousand year door? Tech, is this... Princess, please answer. What is the legendary treasure that waits behind the thousand year door? A hundred million coins! An extremely rare badge. I used to say hundred million because I really didn't want to answer a thousand year old demon's soul. God damn, that's so metal. Thousand year old demon's soul. Correct. Now the fourth question. What does Sir Grotus wish to do with this ancient demon's soul? Cherish it always! Bring the demon back to life. Hang out with it! <laughs> no, bring the demon back to life. Correct. Now the fifth question. What is, the requi what is required to seal up the demon again? A legendary sword, magic spell, the crystal, the crystal stars. Correct. You have correctly answered all five questions. Now you may use the communicator. Tech, you... Was it okay for you to tell me such things? Please input the message you wish to send. It wasn't. But he didn't get, answer those questions. He basically just gave her questions. Uh, okay, I'm done. Could you send it? 
The message has been sent. That is all for now. Please go back to the room. <laughs> She's smiling. Thank you. You're still a weird computer tech. <laughs> Good night, Princess Peach. Oh, that was nice. I think the one after that will now it will be more fun. Save all the game progress to this point. Yeah, I think the this, the thing after this, you know, would be more fun. All right, on to Bowser time. My lord, I've received reports of a great secret in the floating town of Glitzville. Let's ride the cheap blimp there, come now. You there, two tickets, one great and e an evil king and one sweet young thing. <laughs> that kind of rhymed, one, one evil king, one sweet thing. <laughs> good, good, good gravy! B -b Bowser, the evil king and a deluded old hag, I, uh, life's too short. <laughs> YOLO, bitch, you only live once. He walked on the train tracks. What? Did he just say, say- What did he just say? Hey, come back here, you impudent little cheapskate. Hey, I'm talking to myself. Where'd Lord Bowser go? Ha <laughs> ha Look at this guy. Grahahaha! Forget that wimpy blimpy! I'll be riding this baby! I snuck into Glitzville once before, so I know the way, no problemo! You go easy on your old limbs and take the slow ride on the blimp, Grandma! <laughs> I was confused at first. I thought he like he already been to Glitzville. I mean of course he has, but like, you know, he'd been there by himself because he heard Mario was there. Wait, Lord Bowser, please! Aww! And now my special di D during durable deluxe brown bag cami lunch will go to waste. <laughs> I was having problems with that name. <laughs> okay, it's 6:14. After this, then you know. Yeah. Huh? That that don't sound good. What's that warning light? Oh, don't tell me. Arr! He forgot to fill the gas. Or it broke. <laughs> Ready to roll. Now we're in water. Oh, look at Bowser. Oh shit, fuck. Come on, oh god. Aw, oh, damn. You can't fire- oh shit. It's hard to move in water, fuck. Let me at him. I have to fire breath that thing. There we go, that's how I was supposed to do it. Oh shit. An X dot, by the way. Oh, no, 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 no. oh god damn it, I was pressing A. Watery ears. <laughs> this is a lot harder than I thought. I mean, because it's water, that's why. Water worlds are like fucking cheap ass, that's why. Oh, okay. Wait, 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 yeah. For... Okay, that's how I'm supposed to do it. But. There we go. Okay, I gotta get this. Get inv invincibility. There we go. Yeah, because the X knots like fall from the sky. Oh my so oh okay I remember there's a trampoline. Wait. Oh there it is. Oh no fuck. Come on, come on! Oh god! Ha! <laughs> I forgot there was a Oh my god, that, that would have been a way to get to have disappointments, would it? <laughs> Alright, but I made it, so... Ugh, 
Ooh, dude, that was terrible. I gotta get in shape. Who's- Wow, it's Bowser the Koopa King! He'll eat us! Someone help! <laughs> He's not gonna eat shit. Look at that! Look at this! It's so fucking cute! Look at her! She, has, she was having fun. I fucking love Cammy. Is that her name? Yeah, Cammy Koopa, right? There you are, Lord Bowser! What are you doing here? I've been looking all over! If I may ask, where have you been, your sogginess? Swimming? Really? Neat! As for me, Glitzville was fantastic! The fights were so cool! I was overcome, why even at my age, I was shaking what my mama gave me. <laughs> God damn, I love, I love this character. And then the hot dogs, oh my gracious, Yummerly, you have fun too, hmm? I fucking love her. <laughs> oh my god, he's pissed. Lord Bowser, is that a no? It was terrible, you hear me? I swallowed a dang blooper. I wanted to have fun! But forget it, it's over. Go get go get me some solid info on Princess Peach and the Crystal Stars now! Haha. <laughs> that was so fucking funny, I love it. <laughs> I love this. <laughs> wow, that was so nice. All right, there we go. I can't believe it was a fake Mario all, the, all that time, so we were all fooled. I'm so sorry, Mario. After all you've done for our town, did we hurt your feelings? Nah, not really. You're a bigger man than I, than I Mario. Such fortitude. You're a true hero. You've brought a shining ray of light to our dim little town, Twilight Town. Th uh, thanks, Twilight Town thanks you. Hey Mario, we need to get back to Rogueport, right? Let's go. Please come back to visit anytime you like. Please come back to visit anytime you like. Okay, that's about it. Yeah, and that was it. That was the level. You know, I always used to love pork chops, but now I think about the poor pig. Hmm, hey, you don't think maybe I was a pig in a past life, do you? What, what a concept. Huh, <laughs> a little reincarnation reference right there. Yeah, so that's it. So what I'm gonna do... I'm just gonna... I'm gonna save right next to the Thousand Year Door because after that there's like some important dialogue that frankly is gonna talk about uh, that I will definitely read and stuff, so that's what I'm gonna do. Oh my goodness, Mario, would that be an email from Princess Peach? My dear Mario, I have finally learned what the legendary treasure is. It is the spirit of a demon. The ex plan to revive this thousand-year-old monster. And, yet, and use its power to take over the world. They're collecting the crystal stars so they can open the thousand year door. They'll find this demon spirit. But the only thing that can keep it locked away is the crystal stars themselves. You must not let them get the crystal stars. Please Mario, you must put a stop to their horrible plans, Princess Peach. And ancient demon spirit- Wouldn't she know? Obviously, the Shadow Sirens came from the Palace of the Shadows, which is behind the Thousand Year Door. They're basically servants to the Shadow Queen. So wouldn't she basically re reveal all, every single information that the x knots have? Like, I'm pretty sure she knows about that. <laughs> like, that's one huge plot hole in this entire game. Unless, like, it's only Vivian that knows, and she basically keeps everything a secret. But then that begs the question, how would she, like... Like I said, she's from the Shadow Realm, the, the, the Palace of Shadows, so she would know everything that's happening. I'm just saying, this is a huge plot hole in the entire game, you know? Like, I mean, seriously. Unless maybe Mind Wipe or some shit, I guess? I don't know. Maybe I'm gonna go with Mind Wipe, because that's like the only explanation in the entire game. Yeah, so anyway, uh... I can't go to the shortcut unless I have Bobbery, so I'm just gonna, yeah, go, I have to go up the surface and, oh, fucking hell, come on. So, yeah, that's about it. That, that was the game. Uh, I talked about my Halloween story. Uh, I know there's another, like, not so good Halloween moment, but... Actually, never mind. It's just way, it's way too long to, to talk about, so... Yeah, I'll, I'll probably explain about it later.
funny thing about this, you know, doing these gameplays, this is actually the very first time I actually liter literally talk about Halloween and stuff, because thing is though, okay, very first time I'd, I've started doing this was in 2016. At that time I already finished uh, Legend of Zelda in October, but that was during the 2016 election at that time, so I was kind of... I was kind of a little depressed to talk about Halloween because of the 2016 election, and and then there's 2017, and at and at that time I was way too busy talking about the My Little Pony movie, well before My Little Pony movie, but actually mainly I was way too busy talking about uh, Super Mario Odyssey at that time. I did say I was like I had this week called Mario Week, and I was basically talking all about Mario. I also had some uploading problems, that's why. So I wasn't able to talk about Halloween even in 2017. 2018 was my only year I had I had the time to talk about everything about Halloween and stuff. And I'm glad I talked about it, because it was a very nice little conversation that I had. That I've, that I've been talking about, I would say. Conversation with you guys, basically. So yeah, that's about it. Actually, I'm probably gonna skip the dinner offer that my brother is offering because I want to spend some time editing a few videos and stuff because I want to get this right out before Halloween. I feel this is way too special to pass over. So yeah, I'll be having fun this Halloween. Get all your like spooky skeletons and pumpkins and all that great stuff, candy, whatnot, and just have a great time. As for me, I'd probably just go on the internet going looking at Halloween memes. I'll go on 4chan, they always celebrate Halloween and stuff with those little skeleton, uh, skull things in the background. But yeah, as for me, I'll be celebrating Halloween and stuff, you know, and I'm looking forward to it. I mean, um, tell, tell me about what you like about Halloween. What are you going to do this year and like what you're planning to do? I'd really love to hear about you, your, you guys about Halloween and stuff. So yeah, leave it in the comments. So yeah, anyway, thanks for watching, like and subscribe, and I will see you all next time.